Hey, this is Big Dave. I wanted to uh, cover a couple of points on this uh, new technology that Intel has introduced. It's uh, Intel's Smart Response Technology. Uh, others might call it uh, SSD caching. As you know, solid state drives are um, becoming more popular, uh, very much widely used because of the speeds that you gain over old mechanical drives. Now, the prices are still up there. Um, they, uh, for an equivalent 128 gig drive, you're, you're still going to pay about $200 for one. That's um, fairly expensive where you can get uh, a mechanical drive that's four times that capacity for the same, um, basically the same price. Now, Intel's smart response technology, SSD caching, uh, what it does is it pairs uh, your mechanical hard drive with a smaller SSD and um, doesn't use the SSD storage, it uses the storage of the mechanical hard drive and uses the SSD as a cache, speeding up the performance, increasing the performance of your mechanical drive. Um, depending on the speed of the SSD and the combined speed of the mechanical drive, um, if, your, uh, if your SSD is, is uh, Let's see, I think it's 32 gigs to 64 gigs in size. That's about all you need to assist with the caching capabilities for your mechanical drive. Um, says here um, we've got intelligent real-time cache improvements for HDD performance. And uh, it scales across all HDD capacities from all vendors. So what that does is, what that means is you're basically setting it up as a RAID array, uh, essentially probably a RAID, oh, there's there's no real good comparison. A RAID 0 combines capacity of two drives and the speeds of two drives. Um, in this case, your SSD is going to be invisible to the system. Your system's only going to see your mechanical drive and its capacity. Your SSD is going to be invisible, transparent. Um, you're just going to see the uh, results through the speed increases to your mechanical drive. Uh, easy UI for enable, disable, embedded uh, in Intel Rapid Storage Driver. It's um, uh, easy to set up basically and um, you're only going to see this through Intel chipsets. So the current chipsets that support this are Z68. So look for a motherboard with a Z68 Northbridge chipset and that's where you're going to uh, uh, get your capabilities for SSD caching. Uh, easy plug and play SSD implement, imp, implementation. Uh, so you can buy a 32 gig to 64 uh, gig SSD. Fairly cheap. You can probably get one for $50, 50 to $100. And, uh, and uh, you're going to connect it through a SATA a 2.0 or 3.0. I would assume if you get a 3.0 and your board supports the 3.0 speeds, then you're going to get an increased speed to your mechanical drive from that super uh, speedy cache coming from your 3.0 capable SSD drive. Uh, uses off the shelf SSDs, no special connectors or firmware required. So take your pick. If you prefer Corsair, if you prefer uh, crucial, um, you know, wh whatever your preference is for an SSD, it's it's your choice and it's your pick, and it also goes with mechanical HD HDD drive. Um, would prefer that that HDD drive is a minimum of one terabyte. So um, those are those are fairly common nowadays. One terabyte, two terabyte is what you typically see in a new PC. Um, in today's standard PCs anyway. Cache frequently used applications to improve system performance and responsiveness. So you're going to see improved boot times, you're going to see improved um, improved application load up times, you're going to see for your gamers out there, you're going to see improved uh, gaming response and loading times. Um, it's a uh, it's definitely a good investment and um, and definitely something to look into if you're looking to go with the Z68 
chipset. Now, if you're going with the Z68 chipset, it's probably mainly because of this um, SSD caching Intel Smart Response technology. So, uh, I'm uh, going to be purchasing my first Z68 uh, motherboard. It's going to be the Asus P86 uh, or the Asus P8Z68 Deluxe motherboard. And um, I will be doing some benchmarks on that. I'm not going to be using the Intel Smart Response technology because I'm running my primary OS, Windows 7 64 bit, off of a primary SSD, which is 256 uh, gigabytes in size. So, um, so I've, I've uh, basically steered clear of mechanical drives altogether. But price conscious, if you have an existing drive, this is the way to go. I've got several mechanical drives. Um, I just wanted to get that extra speed, but uh, uh, for the price conscious shopper who wants that extra boost um, for a lower uh, price uh, than the standard SSD as a primary OS drive, Intel Smart Response Technology is, is the way to go. So uh, I appreciate you watching. Please subscribe, uh, add some comments, uh, let me know what you think about SSD caching. And uh, let me know what your personal experiences are, are yielding in this, uh, this new market, this new technology. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, have a good day.